winds, that low humidity, and that's why we've seen these fires pop up around the foothills and the northeastern plains, even in Golden. So it's been really dangerous. We really could use some moisture. We we're not it. we're not really <laughs> seeing a lot of it just yet. Taking a look at our radar and satellite, we're under a mostly cloudy sky, dry statewide across Colorado, and it is cool. It's a nice start to our Friday. So if you have any plans throughout the day, today should be a nice day to do so. The winds will be a lot calmer. So that's the good news around town. Fire danger not quite as high. Taking a look at our temperatures though, 31 right now in City Park, 30 in Littleton, up into Boulder, same at 30 degrees. Now in terms of our wind speeds across the western slope, sustained at around 12 miles per hour. And then the breeziest part of our state yesterday was up into the northeastern corner, currently Sterling at a wind speed of around 10 miles per hour and will continue to stay relatively calm throughout much of the day today. Taking a look at our future cast as we head into this afternoon, we'll start to see an increase in cloud coverage across the metro area up into Fort Collins, but we will stay dry. It'll be late tonight into early tomorrow morning. Spots like Steamboat over across the northwestern corner of our state. We'll see a rain snow mix and then it'll be early, early tomorrow morning. As you can see, a chance for snow in our mountains and then a slight chance of seeing some rain showers across the metro down into Aurora and then across the western slope. Really, we're not looking though at much in the way of accumulation because by 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, things will be nice and dry. So if you have any weekend plans, it should be a very beautiful weekend, a little bit cooler for tomorrow, but still above normal in terms of our seasonal values. 53 is our typical high for this time of the year. Yesterday, we were in the upper 60s to low 70s. Same story today. By 9 o'clock, we're in the 40s. So if you're stepping out the door soon, just make sure you have a sweatshirt, a jacket. It's cool. We're in the 20s and 30s, but by 1 12, 1 o'clock, upper 60s, and then this afternoon near 70 degrees. Your front range forecast 69 in Fort Collins and Boulder, up into Greeley near 68 degrees, and then elsewhere around town. Parker, you're at 69, Centennial, same out to Aurora, so it'll feel very spring like by this afternoon. Westminster at 67, and these temperatures will feel really nice because the wind won't be quite as gusty this afternoon. High temperatures statewide. Gunnison, you're at 41, but in the valley levels near Eagle, almost 60. 60 degrees there, 49 in Steamboat, and then not quite as warm down to the southeastern corner of the state near Lamar at 61 with low 60s in Sterling. So tonight in Denver, 37 is our overnight low, so not quite as chilly as what we felt this morning. And then we'll start the morning with that chance for rain, and then that'll really quickly clear out. So by 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, most of that moisture will pass through. We're not looking at really anything in the way of measurable precipitation, but we could really use some, so crossing our fingers that we get a little bit. 58 Eight degrees in Denver for our expected high temperature. So quite a bit cooler tomorrow, about 10 degrees. So by Sunday, 62 is our expected high. Also remember daylight savings. Set your clocks forward by 2 a.m. on Sunday. We'll spring forward and by Monday, 55 degrees. So a bit cooler, closer to our normals. And then Tuesday, mid to upper 60s, mild and dry. Next best chance of seeing a few showers would be Wednesday. I